is your person thinking about communicating if this is something you want to know let us just check that so if you are in no communication and um, if if your person has no like not contacted you yet um, this reading might be for you but before i say that um, take what resonates leave what doesn't if you know your person has moved on with third party fourth party fifth party or they are doing their own party i don't care I, this is not your reading okay um, so if you really have interest in knowing is i don't care if they message me or not why you are watching a tarot reading okay so if somebody who really cares whether the person going to message or not stick around otherwise scroll do whatever jingalala i don't care and uh, what i was to say yeah um what was that blank all right yeah so i have only one account divine mother's guidance with 100k followers in tiktok i have only one account divine mother's guidance with 3600 uh, 3400 followers in instagram scammers steal my video and they make fake profiles to make me famous that's okay but the bad part is they try to scam my followers they follow them and they just offer them reading and dm readings i don't do that shit so if if you see anybody messaging you offering you a reading uh, instagram um, beloved i got a message from your spirit guides and shit please block them please block them okay so now think about your person and let us see whether this person going to message you or thinking about messaging or not bottom of the deck the <laughs> queen of swords so this person is seeing you as a queen of swords and underneath the nine of wands there might be blockages you might have blocked them they might have blocked you this person sees you that you are sitting there at your power you don't you're not going to give them any any you know you know clinch it you have to she blocked her heart here see this this is her emotion the cups are emotion she blocked her emotion here now she is guarding her emotion with a sword so if you come to me come clean otherwise fuck off literally fuck off don't come to me if you want to come and talk bullshit this is the energy so this person is seeing you as a queen of swords and i need that nine of wands energy so this person is feeling they they have to come forward message you they have to be very clean otherwise oh too many cards here why okay the fire whatever let's see what comes up are you going to come with a message are you going to come with a message Seven of Pentacles. What was the bottom of the deck? Four of Swords. All right. The Wheel of Fortune. Six of Wands. The Sun. The Queen of Pentacles. The Seven of Swords. The Seven of Pentacles. And the Nine of Pentacles. All right. Um. So let me tell you the story. Okay. Just everybody has their own intuition. Everybody has their own way of interpreting the cards. Okay. Anyways. let us start um if you ask me if this person is thinking about messaging you right now i would say not right now they are not thinking about you messaging about you right now at this moment no what i'm seeing here yeah this person is seeing you as a queen of swords and this is your energy nine of pentacle um the, the person is seeing you as that you don't care about this shit anymore at this moment you are not going to take any bullshit from them you are focusing on yourself your life your career you are not just wasting your time thinking about them like every moment now you are totally focused on them so now this person is realizing they are realizing that they cannot come and bullshit around you okay they cannot do wrong things to you anymore in past they have done a lot of wrong lot of conflict been happening in this connection i can see that lot of conflict okay um it's it might have been an every day in every day new fight you and their thoughts are just not aligning at this moment it's like they are feeling like okay uh, whatever happened whatever is the breakup is a, whatever the reason they are still inside they are seeing like there are a lot of differences between us those conflicts are still bothering you and bothering them too okay and i'm with the seven of swords i'm feeling like this person might have lied lied to you they might have cheated on you okay this reading is a collective reading it it this is it looks like it's not for everyone okay remember it looks like a for a collective um who knows what i'm talking about so this person might have cheated on you or might have lied to you something they hide which came on the surface and you really got shattered and you came to in a terms like okay after this happened i can only take you back if you come clean to me otherwise don't come to me all right so i'm sensing this is your energy and in after that this person got literally pissed off with you but they are seeing that you are not that queen of cup anymore you been the giving caring and nurturing the, you always prioritized them before but now you are the queen of swords you are now focused at on your own life you are not give that priority to any anymore to them now you you are on the pedestal you 
are loving yourself you are prioritizing yourself so if they see you previously used to be only the giving them you know excuse me understanding their side always loving them and you know be there all their side all the time but now they understood that they might have done this kind of shit so long be before also but you forgive them but this time you're not going to do that this is what they are thinking and they are understanding that okay you might be very intuitive person water sign energy um you know cancer scorpio pisces you can be very intuitive or like a healer you know tarot reader yourself or whatever it is um yeah so um this person is now seeing that you are not that queen of cup energy anymore you are now queen of shorts you are they cannot come to you like that um however i'm sensing like with the sun and the wheel of fortune um this person will change the things will turn in your favor because when the wheel of fortune comes with the sun it's like this wheel is turning in your favor the happiest card of the deck is sun so this is going to be okay with you this is going to be a happy ending for you but you know you will get the winning you know you, you will get the victory so you, you don't have to go back to this person but you need to have some patience here you need to have some patience it's brewing it's it's happening it's you, you even if you're not seeing anything going on but it is happening because you know this is there is healing going on in this what happens people only think about manipulating other people people only think about what i can do that this person get come um, misses me and come back to me but you know what the best thing you can do is focusing on yourself this is this works like a spell when you pull the energy back and focus on yourself that is the time the other people start reflecting back to you okay so what you are doing right now you are focusing the energy inwards you are now working on your self love you are working on your business you are working on your money you might be a white like you know white witch or a herbalist or something like that um yeah so you are focusing on your money your career and all those things this is actually working but you might be saying oh nothing is working this person is doing jingala la they're not showing any sign of doing anything but actually it is working it is working but you are not seeing on the surface you are seeing this much but this is what is going on all your hard work is paying off so this person is not yet ready to message you not yet ready but they are really thinking about you and they are actually missing that queen of cups that's going on so i believe this patience will turn this wheel in your favor and this person will come forward with some message so let me see um let me see take some different cards to see uh what this person might do um in terms of incoming actions what you going to do are you going to take any actions or not after this wheel of fortune what can we expect what can we expect after this wheel of fortune i'll take three cards and let me see what it shows first card is eight of wands yeah they will message you they will okay death okay that death is the ego death up for this person and the last one is the emperor okay i got the answer you keep doing you you keep doing you whatever you are doing it is going to take a little bit longer for this case so whoever this reading is for it is going to take a longer this person is still in the emperor energy they are thinking they are going through all this internal conflicts they are going through all those uh, internal turmoil and all those things but that ego the, the emperor is the ego the person with a huge ego but that ego death will come this person will go through some ego death and then the communication will come so don't wait for the communication do the don't just sit there you do your life you do focus on your life you keep on doing the good work this person will come back to you at divine timing but again i never ask people to wait for that you keep doing your life okay if this person is supposed to come because it is a collective reading it is not for it's not a personal reading so if this person is supposed to come they will come if they don't come that's their loss okay you are not going to sit there and you know waiting for them forever you need to move on with your life do your life focus on your development own personal development self love is important give yourself the love that you were waiting for this person to give you okay i hope it helps take care bye